Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as Chief of News. Today is August the 28th, 2020. This is our Kyber Network Price Prediction Update. Going to answer the question whether or not Kyber Network is a buy. You're going to find out right here today on this particular video. We're going to make some updates to our price chart. Now, it's been a very long time. You guys can look at the price chart. A lot of action has occurred since our last video, which was done on July the 12th, 2020. So. It's about time for us to revise this price chart, get an idea what the trap is trying to do with the value of Kyber Network, and also try to answer that question if this cryptocurrency is still a buy. So, if this is your first time watching our video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, join us on our other social media platforms, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, uh, our own website, we are at those locations, so make sure you join us in order to make sure you stay ahead of everyone else. You know, you got to be ahead of the trap in order to maintain profitability and even get profits out the market. Nothing else matters. Price is the only thing that is cumulative and it's the most important factor in determining whether or not a actual cryptocurrency has value uh, protocol because people put their beliefs with their dollars, with their currency. And once you're able to determine what majority of everyone is doing, you can also follow right along with the trap to capitalize on it. It's just that simple. Do not make it complicated like so many other people on this platform is trying to do. Now, let's talk about the performance from the trap since our last video, which was right here on around August the 9th, 2020. You guys can see here that we were playing for the market and Kyber Network to continue to see movement higher in price and it has done that it's been a lot of volatility into the market in Kyber because look at these spreads of these price bars on a daily basis they're very wide and it lets you know that the trap is having a phenomenal time filling his bag and maintaining that profit for himself he's playing the market he's tricking people into thinking that the value of Kyra is going to go higher, then it's going to go turn around and go lower. But for us, we saw the market strength coming to the market in Kyber right there on August the 9th. Now, granted, the next two days from when we did this video, the market went lower. Right? And many people may feel as if the market was incorrect, but that's not the case. Sometimes you have to allow the market to work itself out in order for you to actually get that TP out. So yeah, it took us about three days, but then on the fourth day, look at that. On August the 13th, the market came and ultimately tagged out our TP area. So at least 8.48% could have been into your account, into your pocket, following our video that was completed on August the 9th. So it took us four days in order to allow the trap to play out our forecast, okay? Now that's done, that's over. We need to talk about the market now, update you all on what we're seeing in terms of whether or not this market and Kyber is a buy. Because zooming out, you know, we don't have that much history here on the Binance Exchange for Kyber. And on top of that, the market is really in a massive consolidation range. So let me circle it for you. Look at this. This is where the market in Kyber is really just trading at. So this tells you this area around a dollar forty five for support all the way back up there to a dollar ninety five is where the market is actually handing handling its business. I mean, we're finding a great balance between the buyers and sellers. That's it. Now, once the trap gets done with this trading range is when the next massive movement is going to occur whether it's back down to the downside or a breakout to higher price. Let's get rid of that. So let's take this line right here and we're going to show you what trend the market is currently in in Kyber. Okay. And it's right there. So we're, we're tracking lower in value for this particular currency right the market in kyber is showing that it is making higher i mean making lower highs 
in the market that simply means that every trading day the market is making a lower high than the previous one right that's an indication of weakness but I'm gonna take this same line and I'm gonna show you how the market is still trending for a long-term perspective high in price and this literally just continues to go to show you that anybody can place lines on a chart and and tell a story right the true storytelling comes in to where you're actually able to determine what the trap is trying to do and we've been doing and we've been doing that precisely since 2017 of tracking the footprints of the trap so when you look at Kyber network here on Binance, the trend into the market in Kyber is still trending higher in price. Yes, the intermediate time frame, we are seeing lower price. But right here, I will say in between this $1.50 to $1.55 area is where we're seeing some hints that the trap is definitely trying to hold price. And the next thing is that the volume over the last five trading days is literally non-existent comparative to what we saw during mid-August 2020. So we need to pay attention to that. Okay. So real quick, weekly time frame in Kyber. Again, you guys can see that the gyrations, the spread of these weekly price bars continues to reflect that the trap is having a wonderful time making these transactions between buyers and sellers literally okay so how we're going to play this market in kyber is we're going to continue to play some strength in this space but i'm not telling you that the market's going to catapult or moonshot its way all the way up there to ten dollars you know you get a lot of people trying to fomo yourself into this space but we're being more realistic into how the market really works all right so we're going to play some strength into the market in kyber network and this is the reason why first the market is still trending above this line we're seeing some market strength come in from the from the daily price bars around a dollar fifty dollar fifty five and we're looking for a tp price around a dollar sixty five in the market in Kyber, which would be about 3.19%, but then again, 6.32 at $1.70. Okay, this goes to show you that I'm not really seeing um, the market being biased in terms of where it's trying to go. All right, for the most part, I'm still looking for the market in Kyber to trade that range uh, that I've shown you when I circle how the market has been trading since it's been listed on Binance. Okay, so within that range, I'm just looking for the market in Cairo just to go a little bit higher. This is our presumption. This is what we're looking for to the trap and how he's going to handle the market. And again, what's yours? What's your forecast? What's your prediction? What do you see the market in Cairo doing over the next couple of days to weeks? Leave us a comment in the comment section. Tell us your forecast, higher, lower, sideways trading, and give us a TP price as well. In the meantime, make sure you maintain a profitability and I'll talk to you all on the next one.